Hi everybody, and welcome back for another video. I'm sorry, I have very little voice. Um, I've been getting over a cold that I've had this summer. It's not that other thing, but it's just a general cold. Um, but I have an unboxing here from Print Pression. He was having a sale, I think a five year anniversary sale. And I placed a little order. And let's see. So it came with some little goodies. It came with some Scribble Prince Code Deco stickers. And some print pression. Ooh, those are so pretty. June and July. I might save those for next year. But this is what I ordered. And some of these. Everything else is... If your dreams don't scare you, they're not big enough. I'm gonna set this box aside. So, when I saw he was having this sale, I decided to place an order for something small and some things to go in it. So you see I got some pocket dividers and a couple of the dashboards. And let's see what we have. Feels really nice. Uh, it is, I forget the name of it. It is a pocket ring folio with an elastic closure, and it is in the Sophisticate collection, and the color is called Latte. And, oh, that looks so nice. Here's what it looks like from the back. It does have the back pocket. And this was on sale for $14.99. That was why I got it. Um, I do have a little collection of pocket rings. Oh, they say print pressure on the rings now. That's new. I don't know if I can zoom in or bring it close enough but there's a tiny little print pression right there I've been wanting to set up a pocket rings I have one set up right now for a personal planner or a personal finance planner um, but I was wanting to do something else in rings and I didn't want to use any of what I have. The rings are nice. And it looks like they're the screw type, so you can, um, you know, replace them with a different color or bigger or smaller. And so it has, like, an ID pocket, another, like, credit card pocket, a secretarial pocket, a deep pocket and another deep pocket then it has one two three four card pockets and then another deep pocket and this is really nice it has a zipper here for like holding change another thing and it actually goes all the way to here so it's actually quite deep um, and I do like that it has this little flap down here to kind of, you know, protect your inserts. It looks really nice. And there is a little, it says print pression right there. The only thing I find a little funny is the way it's finished up here at the top. That I find a little, for it being the sophisticated collection, I find that a little unfinished. Did you see that? But it's a cute little planner, and it was only like $14.99. So let's see what it looks like with, these are the dashboards, the side. I have a couple from uh, Filofax. Oh, and they have a little thing that says print pression sort of on them. The Filofax ones have a top opening. It's kind of nice to have a, a 
side opening, a little something different. Um, and let's see what the dividers look like, because I've never seen his dividers before. Attention, I have protective layers on my clear dividers that help me stay pretty for you. Please remove them before decorating me. Okay. So number one, there's a page lifter. I'm just gonna remove the little I'll just continue to leave those on for right now. So there's the page lifter. Now I think this ring binder will actually hold uh, pocket plus or pocket inserts. So that is really nice to know that I guess there's a total of four dividers in the page lifter. I've bought dividers in the past from cloth and paper. And I think those came with like maybe five. Here, let's pull those little. I'm gonna leave the protective coating on for right now uh, because I'm not sure what I wanna do with the dividers. And so I thought it would just be a lot easier in the there we go. Okay, so we have the two dashboards. There's one, there's two, and then I have the four dividers and the page lifter in the binder. This was just gonna be a quick little unboxing. What I will do is I'll have some videos in the future where I will share my entire collection of pocket rings because that's the most that I have. Uh, I've got a couple of Filofax. I have a Vanderspeck. Um, I did have a Foxy Fix, but I sold it. Um, I have another one by Kane uh, with like a really chunky clasp. So it'll be, It'll be fun for me to share what I have, and then I'll do another video where you can see how I choose to set this up. Okay, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.